Hello, welcome to Linda Likes Tarot. Hi, my name is Linda. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, what's up? I'm glad that you're back. Okay, so today this reading is going to be for whoever it's meant to be for. <clears throat> Please be your own leader of discernment while watching this general reading. Not everything is going to resonate with you and that is okay. Pick up what does resonate with you and drop the rest for someone else to appreciate. All right? All right. Don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button is greatly appreciated and it does help out the channel. All right. Look at all that smoke from such a small stick. <laughs> ooh, that's symbolic. Okay, so whoever I'm speaking to, ooh, whoever I'm speaking to, you pack a punch. Okay. There's a lot of people that underestimate you, and they're about to see your full potential, your full power. They're gonna see what you're working with, or maybe this is your green light to put yourself out there okay i don't know that's for some of you not all y'all you guys could be seeing the number eight a lot okay um eight is a number of abundance eight is also the number of karma what goes around comes around okay so there's definitely karma playing out good karma and bad karma at this time i feel like there's someone here that you know that is going to be reaching out okay to you this person feels um they feel in the karma and i feel like this person wants you to feel bad for them okay i'm just that's just a warning i'm giving you a warning mentally prepare yourself okay i also feel like someone here it could be crying a lot because i'm looking over here and this card is looking at me i also feel like maybe this person is genuinely crying because um they're they feel convicted Okay, or someone here might be getting convicted of a crime. Who knows, child? At the bottom of the deck, it does say balance. So this could be regarded as something when it comes to legal matters. Don't have to, but yeah. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, somebody here might ring your bell. Okay, because this card says bell here. Someone's last name could be bell. Or somebody's bell uh, the bell has been rung okay there's some sort of final judgment here okay being called upon someone and i don't think it's just one person i think it's a lot of people okay they're gonna be going through a lot okay they thought these are people that were us against them kind of vibe like up against one person um confirmation these people are going to be experiencing some sort of karma okay holy spirit holy angels what the heck is going on what do they need to hear at this time i hope you guys are enjoying a beautiful this beautiful sunday i i don't know i think it's easter but i'm not sure holy spirit holy angels tell me more. this is the last of the month the last day of the month of march what do they need to hear this for? What do they need to hear regarding this message? Okay. We have what do you need to release? So there's something here about releasing, okay? This could be something that you need to release emotionally at this time, okay? Or people, places, or things. It could be snowing where you're at. That's for some of you, not all y'all. Okay. Tell me more. What the heck is going on? We have a time to give rather than to take, okay? Honestly, for whoever I'm speaking to, if you're on the good side of right, all right? I feel like right now is a good time for you to, like, give back to yourself at this point. Okay? That's what I feel like, but... Someone here could be a Virgo or they could have Virgo somewhere in their chart. I also feel like somebody here who is a taker needs to start giving something. I don't know. Giving an apology. We have a new romantic cycle begins. New moon in Libra. Something here is definitely being balanced out. So we got two pictures of the, the scales of justice here. Okay. Something here about Anubis could also be significant as well don't have to be there's two new moon cards out here so something significant about the new moon that's coming up um 
that's on the 8th of April. There could be a, a tough cycle here that is going to be completed or is going to be ended or finished or something completed, blah, 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 okay? Or whoever was trying to put you through tough situations or trying to block your forward movement, this person is going to be eclipsed from your life, okay? Because whoever this person is who is a blockage, they were blocking your romantic life for some of you, okay? Or they were just blocking your abundance in general. That's why this person needs to be released. All right. We, we have, so far we have Libra, Virgo, and Capricorn out here. These could be your signs or you could um, have the, and you could be dealing with these signs. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what is going on? What else do they need to hear? Yeah, we have train, change and transition. It says, thank you, Azrael, for leading me safely through this change. So when this this, uh, this solar eclipse goes down, there's going to be a lot of changes happening. Just count your blessings, all right? Live your joy. We have thank you angels for supporting me as I follow my joy. Continue to go after the things that your heart truly desires. All right. I also feel like a lot of these changes are happening so that you can live your joy. So you can do what your heart desires. Okay. We have honor your beauty. It says thank you, Jafel, for helping me discover my inner and outer beauty. Yeah, I'm getting something about a message of self-care. Somebody somebody here needs to give themselves some more love. Okay, at this time. Show yourself some more compassion. Or be gentle on yourself. If you're someone who tends to be very critical of yourself, uh, you need to fucking chillax on that. Okay? It's time to... It's to take time to breathe. It's time for you to breathe. Breathe in breathe out <sighs> okay we have t uh thank you angels i breathe with ease knowing you're here you are not alone when it comes to, the, to these changes okay you're not alone when it comes to you going through these changes okay my spirit point angels tell me more I'm also getting like someone's gonna try to attempt to attack like your self esteem or something or how you look so just pay it no mind that's another thing that I'm getting pay it no mind please the people who do that are miserable okay they're miserable people <laughs> holy spirit holy angels what's going on what do they need to hear We have breaking dawn. Something's going to happen within 24 hours, child. Something's definitely going to be changing with this violent. Oh, I said violent. Something might be happening that's violent. Okay. I keep seeing an ambulance. I don't know if someone's going to need medical attention or something. But, um, yeah. Something here is definitely going to be changing. I don't know if someone here is going to be passing away or not. Okay. We have um, Lantern Fairy. This is a clear solution. Something is going to be made clear to you in the morning or something is going to be made clear to you soon, okay? After somebody either transitions or after something changes here, okay? Tell me more. Or, there's, or it's good. It's a good time for you to go within, okay? And meditate. We have Death and the Maiden, Okay? This is, okay, someone here that needs to be eclipsed out of your energy is someone here who was invading your privacy. This could have been someone here who was violating your boundaries um, spiritually or on the 3D, okay? This could have been someone here who was hiring people to watch you or to follow you around. That's for some of you, not all y'all. Please do not get paranoid. Um, or this was somebody here who possibly, for some of you on the worst case scenario, somebody here could have planted like, 
cameras in your home or something creepy um or someone here could have uh hired a spiritualist to always track to see what you got going on or to tap into your energy without your consent um okay or hired a private investigator to do so to follow you around okay whatever it is this is someone here who was trying to have dominance over you in some way have some sort of weird ass control because the person's weird okay this could be family member this could have been a family member an ex of yours a, a friend um a co-worker a boss something child okay maybe this is somebody you don't even know but now now that this listen the tables have turned on this person whoever was trying to be on your wax now they have something from the dead that is on their ass and they can't get rid of it and they get worried something about the number 28 is very significant as well Maybe someone tried to do something to you on the 28th of March and it's got sent back, all right? Someone here could be 28 years old, 24 years old, 23 or 34, don't have to be, all right? Someone here was trying to send you some sort of ghosts or something. Um, I feel like someone here is now being haunted, okay? Either by what they have done to you or someone here is getting haunted by whatever spirits they were playing with that they thought was working with them or was in in alliance with them and they're unfortunately discovering that these spirits or ghosts aren't uh necessarily on this person's side okay that's another thing that i'm getting you guys could be seeing 12:34 a lot on the clock or 12:44 If so, this message is for you. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on? What do they need to hear? What the heck is going on? Come on now. Can I get one, please? Thank you. Yeah, so <laughs> this keeps coming out. We have South Node. Remember. Somebody wants you to remember something. Okay. Somebody wants you to remember when somebody wants you to go back to a state of mind when you had limited beliefs. Someone doesn't like that you've changed. Okay. Whatever. It is what it is. You're someone here who's handling some situation with maturity, or this is your advice is to handle something here with maturity. Alright, because somebody here is just. They're drowning, but they're still trying to grasp at you. Like, it's weird. Okay, so just... <laughs> I pity the fool. Tell me more. Yeah, something here about your second house is driving someone nuts. Someone... You, you believing in yourself is driving someone nuts. Okay? Your ability to um, maintain resources is driving someone nuts. Okay, or how you get your resources is driving someone nuts, okay? Someone's also upset because you value yourself, all right? Maybe this is somebody here that wants to come in and they want you, they want you to devalue yourself or this person wants you to like... Okay, the reason why someone know this is the reason why someone dislikes the fact that you value yourself is because they know that you not associating with them or entertaining them they know you not doing you not doing it is is showing that you value yourself. I hope that makes sense. Like someone wants you to not value yourself, so you'll let them in. I, someone does not want something to change. They don't want something to end, but it's going to. Okay, this could be in the matters of love as well. So just be mindful. You got someone who's still in their south node. Somebody who's scared, fearful. Someone here who has some form of anxiety or they're in some sort of deep shit because of what type of gambles or risks they were taking when it came to fucking with you or betraying you. And now this person wants to come in and act like they want a lovey-dovey makeup. I, but this person's still in their self note. I'm going to keep it 100 with y'all. I don't 
trust this individual to be 100% honest. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, who is this person in their fucking south now trying to come back? This could be an Aquarius that you need to be cautious of, okay? <clears throat> this could be a Taurus that you need to be cautious of. Tell me more, Spirit. This could be someone who has the Chinese zodiac sign of a monkey that you might need to be cautious of. Tell me more. Who is this person still in their fucking south now? Someone here that wants to come in, they want to give you some sort of advice or try to guide you a certain direction, but it's they're trying to put you in the wrong direction. Hold on to your beliefs. Stand strong. Keep your boundaries. All right. Or these are your signs. Flip it where it needs to go, child. There's somebody here that wants you to make the wrong decision when it comes to your twin flame. Okay? So just... All right? You got to figure this out on your own. Listen to what your inner guidance is telling you when it comes to making decisions, when it comes to relationships, or when it comes to your twin flame journey. You would know who your twin flame is. Okay? If you're even on a twin flame journey. Okay? Because a lot of y'all is not. Let me see. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Holy Zodiac signs are involved in this situation. Listen, when it comes to this, I feel like whatever this reading is, it's pertaining to the twin flame journey. And I feel like someone was really trying hard to make sure that this union was not a union. And whoever was involved in that, they're all getting their ass tossed up. Okay. Someone might actually pass away if they haven't already. Someone's fearful for their life. Someone here could be a Virgo, or they could have Virgo somewhere in their chart. Okay, tell me more. We have Aquarius. Someone here could be an Aquarius, or they could have Aquarius somewhere in their chart. We have Gemini. Someone here could be a Gemini, or they could have Gemini somewhere in their chart. Okay, we have Scorpio. Somebody here could be a Scorpio, or they could have Scorpio somewhere in their chart. And then we have Capricorn. Someone here could be a Capricorn, or they could have Capricorn somewhere in their chart. We have Pisces. Someone here could be a Pisces, or they could have Pisces somewhere in their chart. Someone here could be a Cancer, or they could have Cancer somewhere in their chart. But someone owes you money. We have, a, we have Aries. Someone here could be an Aries, or they could have Aries somewhere in their chart. Yeah, someone owes you money. They know they have to give it back to you. Or, or this is someone here who has been taking energy from you. They know they have to pay for that. There's a price to pay for that. We have Sagittarius. Someone here could be a Sag or they could have Sag somewhere in their chart. Confirmation. We have Leo. Someone here could be a Leo or they could have Leo somewhere in their chart. Yeah, if someone was playing in your energy or ciphering off of you, this person, they got to pay the, pri the price. Someone has to pay the price. I don't know what they're going to be paying in, but they're going to be paying the price for something. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what is going on? What do they need to hear? We have receipts, high road. You're being asked to handle something with maturity. I'm telling you this right now. It's not the time to get ratchet. It's not the time to blow your lid, okay? Stay grounded. We have high road, all right? Continue to be unbothered. Continue to be... Continue to brush shit off that doesn't matter, okay? Somebody here has already been proven a piece of shit of a person. There's evidence on this individual of what they tried to do to you or what they have done to you. That someone here is getting fucking exposed. You don't need to be sitting there saying, I told you so. You don't need to do shit. Just sit there, look pretty or handsome, okay? Whoever I'm speaking to don't, just let <laughs> let God do what he got to do. Okay? Tell me more, spirit. Yeah, I could be speaking to the black sheep. Child, you about to get justice. If you come from a toxic ass family dynamic, child, you getting justice in this season. 
I'm letting you know right now. Okay? If you guys have a narcissistic parent, okay, this parent might be passing away. That's for some of you, not all y'all, in order for you to be truly free of something. We have heart fog. It says mixed emotions, unclear feelings, wishy-washy. So there's someone here, okay, that doesn't... This is someone... Ugh. Someone, okay, first off, I feel like someone doesn't know how you feel about them, okay? But this person's going to still try to come in to offer you a cup of love. This is someone here who's guilty of doing something to you. Don't tell me someone's going to get exposed for something and then they're going to try to love bomb you. This is ridiculous. Yeah, someone here is going to be acting real extra okay especially when it comes to like with their words okay this is almost gonna be like there's fire coming out of this motherfucker's mouth about with with all the types of vile shit they're gonna be saying i also feel like you guys could be dealing with a fire sign okay or i'm speaking to one flip it where it needs to go okay someone here is definitely gonna be trying way too hard they're gonna be doing something real dramatic like you need to just continue to stay unbothered please it's not worth your time or your energy we have numbing okay we have numbing here someone here could be self-medicating if this is you you need to knock it off okay someone here could be trying to drink away their problems or distracting themselves with substances okay or okay this is another thing that i'm getting to I could be talking to a black sheep, okay? You could have been someone here who was, uh, this was like your form of escape of a toxic family dynamic was numbing yourself, right? Everyone used to, I feel like there could have been a lot of people in your family or out, or that's connected to your family, right? Like extended family members. They could have believed your immediate family because of, you know, all the shit that they've been talking about you for years, right? Saying like, oh, so and so's a lost cause. So and so is a is a druggie. Is a da da da. Is a loser. All this stuff, right? Black sheep. Um, but they're gonna start to these these extended family members are gonna realize, or whoever is connected to your family, and listen to their fucking lies. They're they're all gonna now see the truth of why you had to numb yourself. They're gonna be like, I understand why. So so and so fucking had to do this felt they needed to do this okay that's for some of you not all y'all tell me more spirit i also feel like whoever i feel like the tables have turned when it comes to the numbing thing too i feel like a lot of your family members could be picking up some sort of uh substance abuse situations because they know they go going to hell we have um subliminal subliminals okay someone here is on the internet trying to talk shit about you basically okay they think they're doing something that's low-key um this could be someone here who's trying to call you out okay or someone here is being passive aggressive with you okay that's for some of you not all of you if you guys have platforms somebody one of your weird ass family members that are getting exposed okay they're on the internet under fake accounts trying to you know get digs put blah, i can't even talk right now they're trying to like insult you in some way okay i'm also getting there's evidence on on somebody here who was doing this who was bullying you online harassing you online there's evidence of this okay This also could be another spiritualist who's doing this because you see how this girl has an onk. She has an onk necklace on. You got a weird ass karmic that thinks you guys are supposed to be together so you so just be mindful you're gonna have someone weird come in trying to trying to convince you that you guys are soulmates and you're not soulmates 
this is someone here that does not want you to re fully release them from your energy or something this is someone here who benefits from your being connected to you energetically okay yeah someone didn't expect you to make a comeback here I'm also, someone's also, I feel like somebody is upset because you do have some sort of like magnetic connection with somebody, okay? You and another person's souls, like, there's a very powerful connection there. And that can't be broken. Someone here is mad about that as well, okay? Listen, somebody just mad because you you're you're killing the game, okay? You're doing well, you're doing good, continue to do what you're doing. Okay, someone is really hoping that you are still in this people pleaser energy. Maybe someone's mad because you're not you're not you stopped the pattern. Okay? This could have been someone who is used to like ghosting you and then coming back or this is someone here is used to shitting on you being mean to you and then you allowing them to come back into their lives like nothing happened like no okay come on. maybe you stop doing that and somebody's mad about it they're like why won't you let me abuse you like this is what this person feels like somebody's mad at you because you won't let them abuse you people are sick Someone here also could have been saying that you have, like, um, uh, someone here could be saying that you, maybe you are, child, I don't know what you'd be doing, but someone here could be saying that, like, uh, I don't know, you have, you're sexual or something, you're sexually open, or someone's trying to paint you out to be someone who's, like, a hewer, a sleut. This is someone that you ghosted. Is saying this yeah someone wants to come in they want to love bomb you they're trying to come in and love bomb you this is ridiculous hell no yeah you got a spiritual narcissist here okay so this could be someone here who's like um even this could be someone who's like traditionally religious that could be trying to bully you or has been bullying you online okay they feel like they they feel like they're more superior than you because of what they believe or some shit or because they're a christian or whatever like or whatever this may be okay it doesn't have to be christianity it could be like someone who's jewish or someone who is muslim or another spiritualist or a satanist i don't know flip it where it needs to go um someone here ha is driven by ego they're not driven by the heart space they're not driven by love and compassion at all okay one more yeah you Listen, I don't want you to get big head, but you 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 are playing a key role in in something here that the divine is trying to do, the change, this change that the divine is trying to usher into this world, okay? And somebody's mad about this. I'm also getting like someone's mad because God chose you. I'm also getting that someone's also mad cuz someone loves you. A particular person loves you. Okay? We have game on. Someone, there's somebody here that has a sexual addiction that wants to play games with you. I also feel like there's someone here who has some sort of sex demon attached to them. This could be someone who's an incubus or a succubus that is getting some sort of negative karma. They could be getting a taste of their own medicine or something here. I don't know. Maybe now people are calling this person a salute or a whore. I don't know, child. Who knows what this is? Or someone here is getting exposed for um, doing something sexual, maybe? Or... Ha or I don't know. I'm also getting like you keeping your boundaries strong. Okay. And not allowing this person back in your life. You're going to have people just trying to say that you're stubborn or you're difficult or some dumb shit because you, because you value yourself. Okay. I'm also getting like someone here is going to start to play the victim like, oh, you won't, uh, you won't talk to me like you're such an evil person or da 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 like just don't just listen. They're going to try everything they can. 
They're gonna try everything they can. All right. Yeah, someone's gonna try to come in. They're not gonna, they're gonna appear to you one way and they're gonna switch up just as quick. Okay, so just be mindful. Be mindful. Someone might come in with a sob story and then when you let them back in, they're gonna switch up on you and probably do something fucked up, okay? Don't allow this, do not give this person the opportunity to betray you, okay? Or to harm you in some way. Someone here feels disappointed because you continue to persevere over any obstacle that uh, they keep trying to send you, okay? You, what What is yours is meant for you, okay? For sure. And someone's also upset because someone has deep feelings for you. Okay? Okay. Let me see. And whoever who knows that you, uh, whoever knows that this per, okay. Whoever has deep feelings for you, there's someone around that person that knows that. You may not know this yet. Maybe this person has not expressed it, okay? But whoever knows that is connected to that person, okay? They could be the one who's trolling the shit out of you trying to provoke you, okay? Trying to bait you into a reaction. Another thing too that you guys need to be aware of, if you end up engaging in an argument or some sort of conflict, a verbal war with somebody, um, that can create a, 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 a an energetic tie, okay? That's another way for someone to have access to you. So please don't, I'm telling you, please do not, don't allow this weird shit to bother you, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, who's coming back? Who has deep feelings for them? Tell me more. Someone here who has the Chinese zodiac sign of a rooster could have deep feelings for you, okay? Tell me more. Or this is your sign, flip it where it needs to go. There could be a Capricorn here who has deep feelings for you. Okay, or you're a Capricorn, flip it where it needs to go. There could be a Virgo here who has deep feelings for you. Okay, or you're a Virgo. We got Twin Flame. Your Twin Flame is nearby you, whoever I'm speaking to. Okay, someone here could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a snake. Note the date. This could be you or your Twin Flame. Okay, maybe for some of you. When it comes to how your twin flame story goes, you guys could have only been in a short-term relationship with your twin flame. Um, maybe something got in the way. Um, I don't think it's like someone cheated or anything. I feel like for some of you, like it could have been like the difference of religion, okay? Maybe the family didn't approve. Something along those lines, okay? What the hell is going on? Or it could have been the differences of uh, race or um, age <laughs> or um, financial status or something or something like that. What's going on? What do they need to hear? We have she. She what? She what, spirit? She, them. So there could have been a feminine energy here that was the leader of some sort of group here. Okay, they could have thought that they were going to be able to get something over on you, but it didn't work. Okay, I'm also getting like somebody here thought they were right, okay, to call you out or something. But they, they could be realizing they were wrong about something. Maybe they thought she'd... They thought that whoever this karmic feminine is, they thought that what she was saying back then was correct. And now they're realizing it was wrong. There could have been a woman who was saying that a baby was somebody's when it wasn't or something. That's for some of you, not all of y'alls. Maybe somebody had to leave you because they got someone pregnant, y'all. I don't know. This keeps coming out, though, a lot.
Someone here was trying to overdo, or someone here was trying to overstep your human rights or something like that. That's for some of you, not all y'all. I'm also getting, there's a feminine energy that knows that they need to do the right thing at this time. I'm also getting, there was someone here who was trying to do something to you when they were up at one point, And now their karma is that they're going to, they're not going to be up. They're going to be going down in some way. Will do right. She. Someone's going to do the right thing. They know they have to. Okay. Or something's going to go down. Something's getting exposed. I feel like. The days are counting down from this person or they're going to experience some sort of karma. So someone here has to say, tell the truth about something. Otherwise, they're going to experience more karma or something. Someone has to go somewhere or they need to write a confession or something. I don't know. Someone has to look. Someone has to look at how somebody writes something. I keep picking this up. Something about somebody's writing. Someone here could be trying to... Someone's comparing someone else's writing to another individual's writing. Maybe someone here, this is about fraud or something. I don't know. I also feel like someone has to go. Someone has to be released. Okay. We got one. There can only be one. Maybe somebody was willing to do anything to be the one for someone, but they're not. Or somebody did something one last time, and now they gotta go. It could have been a him. We have him fast. getting someone doesn't like that you're always right or something like that or they think that you think you're always right something like that okay someone needs to look at them that's literally what it says look at them look at them people look at them look at who look at the family or some sort of ex of yours. Okay, so you could have a toxic ass family, okay, that was accusing you of some shit you didn't do, or an ex, or an ex and a family teamed up to try to accuse you of something, to try to get you locked up, try to put you in the crazy house, or try to get you to lose out on something, okay? I feel like now these people are being looked at, especially a Gemini could be looking guilty for something, okay? My right ear, dude. Well, somebody grandma is mad. Someone has to write something. Something about the month of May is significant. Something's coming back around to someone in the month of May for some sort of doll that they were using. It's no, lo it's no longer working. If someone had a voodoo doll on you, it's no longer working. Maybe someone tried to do, or somebody was poking at a voodoo doll that was supposed to be the image of you, okay? Maybe they tried to do this last May, and now whatever they tried to do to you last May with some sort of voodoo doll, it's now backfiring, okay? Someone's wondering why you live. Why live? Someone's wondering why you're living. <laughs> what is going on? I'm also getting like there's somebody here who doesn't want to experience what's coming around to them. For what they did to their own children. That's for some of you, not all of you. Or what they have done to children. Someone here could be getting in trouble for being inappropriate with children. Sexually inappropriate with children. Okay. Okay. Someone here does not want to be exposed for that or someone here doesn't want to like deal with the punishment. So someone here might be saying, 
Why should they live? So someone here might want to self-delete. That's another thing that I'm getting. There's a lot of voodoo dolls someone has. They didn't make just one. They made a couple of them. Or they have a couple of them. I don't know. That's for some of you, not all y'all. He was to find someone here is there's a man here that's finding something out or something or there's a man that's going to be found out about something that they've been doing for a long time they're going to be getting time for that get time it's going to be long someone's going someone's getting locked up for a long time and it's it's been a long time coming for this person Someone feels like any day now or something. Okay. They didn't think they were ever going to get stopped for something. Someone here could be getting... Somebody here who's old could be getting locked up. Or who's older in age or something. Okay, when someone gets locked up, there's going to be more people being... I don't know if this is a serial killer or what. I don't know. Number more? There's more victims or something? This is number more to see. I don't know. If someone has to, if someone owes you money, they owe you more than what they took or something like that. Something about a sister. Someone here is trying to figure out your number, your phone number as well. Someone's trying to call you. Someone might call you from jail or something. It could be a he, it could be a she, I don't know. Someone says that they will someone says that they'll always adore you. You're all my children? What the fuck is going on? Listen, I'm just, I gotta. What the hell is going on, sir? What the heck is going on? What do they need to hear? So that message is for some of you, not all y'all. So, something about justice, child. I don't know. The the scales have to be balanced. This is the third time this this imagery has come up into this reading. Someone here could be a Libra. I could be speaking to a Libra. Don't have to be. But the truth is coming out. Okay. Justice is happening. Someone here is going to have the book thrown at them. Or someone here has to tell the fucking truth. Okay? I'm also getting someone wants to come towards you and ask you to hear them out about something. Someone wants to talk to you about something. Okay? It's time to talk something out. Or it's time for this person to say what they need to say. Say what you need to say. Um, we have, it's time for action. It says, things are fast-tracked to unfold quickly and smoothly. The number eight, something about the number 18 could be of significance for some of you, not all y'all. Someone here could be, could be born on the 18th. Someone here could be born in 1981 or 1987 or 1971 or 1978. You're being asked to be careful here and to pay attention. Don't automatically assume something here. Because there's hidden information. And there's also something here about you needing to double check something or to read it between the lines when someone comes towards you and communicates something to you, okay? Someone here could be a Scorpio. Someone here could be a Libra Scorpio cusp. We have crystal ball. It says um, intuition, premonition, seeing clearly, discernment, perception, sixth sense. You got to listen to your instinct, okay? 
listen to your your inner knowing pay attention to what your gut is telling you when this person comes in to try to tell you something okay we got chocolate this justice is going to be sweet like chocolate okay and you don't have to lift a finger here you don't have to like get your hands dirty just sit back and relax whoever i'm speaking to if you're someone here who does the right thing you don't need to worry about nothing see how it says it on this card again word that word that do things right This is why you're getting justice, because you do things the right way, okay? There's also something here about, like, you needing to, like, take time out to, like, treat yourself, okay? It's important. We have cabin. Maybe some of you need to um, plan a vacation to go out to a cabin or something. That sounds adorable, right? Some of you could be feeling alone you are never alone okay i'm also getting this person that wants to communicate with you that's taking action to tell you something or ask you something um they know that you're pretty closed off okay from them <laughs> book burning there's a lot of Libra out here, child. One, two, three, four Libra. Someone here was definitely trying to silence the fuck out of you. Be careful of any uh, documents that you sign because someone here could be wanting you or could be trying to make you sign a document to make it... From stopping you from communicating something. Maybe this is like an NDA or something. Someone here wants to get you canceled. Someone wants to limit your freedom in some way. They want to play some sort of mind games with you. Ugh. Sounds like a karmic Libra to me. Mind games. They're forte. Not all Libras, the karmic ones. Tell me more, Spirit. I'm also getting like someone feels like you destroyed the family's reputation or something dumb. Because it says destroyed heritage on this card. Like someone's trying to... Okay, I'm also getting like somebody here... You have somebody else in your family that has gifts, okay? Or had gifts like you, okay? When they were alive. And somebody here could have um, tried to erase this person from the family bloodline or from family history or whatever. I don't know. Something like that. Yeah, we got Urn. This could have been someone who passed away. Or someone here going to pass away, John. Or somebody here is sad or in grief because they feel like they lost you or they feel like they lost at trying to destroy you in some way. All right. Or trying to erase you in some way or play mind games with you. They feel lost or they feel like sad because you see through them or you see something clearly or they're sad about your discernment. <laughs> Ciao. Tell me more. Come on now. Declaration. We, 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 the people. Something about the United States could be of significance. America. America. America might need to defend themselves or to be on guard. Please don't say this. Listen, you're being protected. Or someone's going to protect you because your, your human rights were violated in some way. Okay, that's another thing that I'm getting. I'm also getting like you expressing the truth or telling the truth is protecting you. Okay, so if someone here was attacking you because you were telling the truth about something, the reason why some sort of magic isn't working because you, you're you not in the wrong, you were telling the truth about something. And some someone here could have gotten offended by some sort of truth that you have been communicating or that you communicated or that you exposed or whatever, whatever. 
Um, and so they decided to do or throw magic at you and because they felt like you did them wrong, but truly you didn't do anything wrong. You just told the truth. I feel like, um, I don't know, something like that could be of significance. Someone here could be born in 1993, 1997, 1991, 1989, 1985. Okay. Tell me more. We got emerald here. It says healing, fertility, eternity, reflection, humility. You could be someone who's very humble. Okay. You could be someone who's very mature. Something about your heart chakra being open. You went through some sort of soul growth here. You, whoever I'm speaking to, you have done the inner work to where you are now ready for a strong, committed relationship. You could be someone who's at peace. You could be a Taurus, or you could be dealing with a Taurus, or someone who has Taurus somewhere in their chart. I could be speaking to an Empress. Okay, don't have to be. Tell me more, Spirit. Or you're about to attract a lot of prosperity right now. That's your justice as well. The second house. You might be experiencing an increase in your finances. Okay. Something about your child wants to talk to you. If you guys have children. You guys have a child that could have been rebellious against you. Or for some of you, you guys could have had a karmic child and this... This karmic child has been trying to destroy you. That's for some of you, not all y'all. And now they want to come in and they want to talk to you or something. You may be really standoffish with this child. This child could be still a child or a grown-ass adult. I don't know. That's for some of you. Not all y'all. But we do have this here. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're definitely... Someone here is taking action to break free from a childish-ass person. That's another thing that I'm getting. I'm also getting there's someone here who was acting childish that is planning on hiding in a cabin so that they don't get in trouble <laughs> from the law or something. That's not funny, but that's another thing that I'm getting. Someone here could be a Gemini... A Virgo, a Sag, or a Pisces that's trying to run away from consequences. That's for some of you, not all y'all. Something about siblings as well. Something about a brother and a sister could be of significance. Someone here could be 55 years old or 35, 37, 38, 39... I'm also getting like there's some sort of legal document someone is taking a deeper look at. They're realizing somebody tried to get you out of something. Or they try to rewrite a will. You're getting protected. Someone's coming in. They're helping you. Okay. If this is about like a literal inheritance, you're going to get some news or communication about someone doing something fucked up. Someone here could be a Cancer, an Aries. Something's gonna turn out like a gosh dang fairy tale. I don't know who need to hear this. Cinderella, whoever, <laughs> whoever I'm talking to, child. Okay. Something's gonna end like a fairy tale here. Okay. It's because you 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 decided to believe. You took the chance to believe in the impossible. That's why something beautiful is coming in, okay? There's going to be some sort of romantic ending somehow. There's going to be some sort of happily ever after here. You guys could be seeing a lot of imagery of unicorns or rainbows. This is your confirmation. I'm also getting like somebody now sees clear through somebody's stories that they were telling. Someone here could have been telling a lot of elaborate stories about you or about how something went. And there's somebody here who has discernment and they're seeing through this person. I'm also getting like there could be someone that's going to come in with some wild fairy tale or some wild story to tell you so you could feel sorry for them. Okay. 
your your intuition you're gonna see right through this person you're gonna be like okay that's a great story but um i ain't buying it you know what i'm saying yeah you need to know that you got true grit child there's a whole fortress that's like protecting your destiny you okay and what's for you someone here could be an aquarius you got what it takes all right you have the ability to endure whatever gets thrown at you you got staying power all right it's because you are stubborn that's why let's see that's for some of you not all y'all let's get out big bertha what time is it Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on? What do they need to hear at this time? We have happy. It's your justice to be happy because you have learned the much needed lessons that you needed to learn. It was not easy, okay, but you did it. We have criminal insider trading. There's something here about the stock market that is of significance. Someone here could have been trying to scam you, okay, with money or using money or scam you out of money someone here could have stole something from you or was planning to steal something from you we got robbery at the bottom of the deck tell me more spirit we have pay attention we're solving crimes right here okay so there's something here about a scam we have libra okay so something here about the justice system or something here about a libra karma is a bitch Tell me more spirit what's going on what else they need to her we have bookworm something about a book it's like someone here was trying to make sh trying to get you to not learn a lesson or someone here was trying to get you to like forget what you've learned Or someone was trying to erase some sort of knowledge. Or try to make you forget what you saw or witnessed or something. I don't know, Joe. You too smart, though. I'm talking to you. Someone here, their first, middle, or last name could start with a U. You're accepting nothing but good vibes right now. Tell me more. We have gang activity is of significance that could be under... Um, judgment, a whole group. The fuckery is real, child. Yeah, these people did a lot of things to you out of envy. There's evidence of this. You guys could be seeing a lot of gnats right now. Someone's definitely spiritually spying on you, monitoring you. Pray for them to be blind and deafened. Okay, in the mighty name of Jesus. Tell me more, spirit. You could be an earth sign or you could be dealing with an earth sign. You could have learned your lessons, earth sign, or an earth sign learned their lessons when it comes to you. We have um, clogged, plugged ears. Someone here did, did not want to listen to something, some sort of warning. We have big dick energy. This is someone here who was very much in their ego. They didn't want to listen to something. They were determined to try to get you to go down a different path they were determined to try to trick you out of your spot trying to trick you out of your destiny trying to trick you out of your crown okay child please someone here could be experiencing a lot of bad omens okay we have booked a lot of books <laughs> a lot of books here something's getting put on record or something we got books here or someone here is about to make history child i don't know um someone here getting locked up whoa tell me more spirit we got hands someone here might want to throw hands on you okay or someone here could be trying to do magic on your hands okay um we have exposed someone here is getting exposed okay for doing something illegal child <laughs> someone's getting exposed for all these rumors and lies that they tried to spread out of envy against you Ooh. Someone you blocked is going to try to come, trying to run into you, okay? Tell me more. What else do they need to hear? Spirit. Something about your dreams. Okay. Tell me more, Spirit. Something about 444. You guys can be seeing that angel number. 
We have bees don't waste their time explaining to flies why honey is better than shit. Listen, like I said in the beginning of this reading. Don't waste your energy. Your energy is too powerful and precious to be wasted on trash, okay? We have BBC News. Someone here could be from Britain. Don't have to be, child. Or something here is going to be end. Something's going to end up being on the news. <laughs> we have owl. Okay, you are being protected at this time. There's a change that is definitely coming. You're being warned for it. We have refusing to see positives in one's own life. Someone here is acting like a gosh dang victim. A very pessimistic victim. Someone wants to blame everything that's happening to them on you. This is all because they're envious because you believe in yourself and they don't. They can't see positive things for themselves. We have um, police will find you. So the police are either going to find you or they're going to find someone who lied on you. We have a light on you. Okay. Tell me more. Spirit. Or the police are going to find you because somebody here lied on you. Maybe somebody lied and said that you put hands on them when you didn't. We have abandonment issues. Someone here is going to be getting exposed for doing something because of their abandonment issues. So you could have you could have walked away from someone. You cut them off because you know you knew that they were no good for you. You needed to release it. You were divinely guided to release somebody here. What do you need to release? You were divinely guided to release somebody here, okay? And when you did, you walked away from this individual, their abandonment issues, their unhealed abandonment issues got triggered and they decided to enact some sort of crazy plan to destroy you in some way or to hurt you. This is getting exposed. We have justices on your side, okay? Tell me more, spirit. Oh, wait, I didn't look at this one. Fearless, okay? It's time for you to be fearless. Someone here was trying to get you to be fearful of them or fearful of something here. Someone here is down to their last quarter or something here about the last quarter moon could be of significance. Maybe this is when you're going to hear some sort of communication from authorities about someone getting locked up or something here about a violent crime going down. Or you're going to find out that someone was planning a violent crime against you because you decided to love yourself and... A walk away we have one week this might be happening one week from now okay someone here is doing something weird with the children someone did something weird with the kids or someone was saying that you did I forgot I wrote that at the bottom <laughs> oh Joe Someone's going to try to claim that being attracted to minors is a, is a sexual orientation. Child, please. Let me see what this is. Disgusting. Tell me more. Someone's first model or last name could start with an F. Okay. Someone wants to say my addiction made me do it. Some sort of violent crime. Whoever's in this um, big dig energy or whoever was using the stock market to clean money or whatever they did. Um, they're going to say they're, they're going to blame it on some sort of addiction, substance abuse problem they have. Okay, we have calculative person. Okay, someone here was a very calculative person that was envious of you, spreading rumors and lies. We have, if you know who you are, then you'll know what to do, North Node. Okay. So you, whoever I'm speaking to, you're in your North Node. You're in your North Node. And this is why these people are facing bad karma now. Who is this calculated person? So there's a calculated person that was envious of you and was spreading lies and rumors. Blase, blase trying to destroy you this person's going to come in and try to offer you money maybe hush money or money for you to shut up and not say something about this or something that's gross who's this envious person the envious person is someone you're close to this could be a soulmate so this could be an ex this could be a family member or a close friend okay that was envious of you someone here could have the chinese zodiac sign of a dragon note the date this could be you or this person 
this person could be a leo who was envious of you okay this person could have the chinese zodiac sign of a rabbit you know the date that could be envious of you or flip it where it needs to go child i'm not your mom i'm not your daddy who's this person that's envious someone who has the chinese zodiac sign of an ox you know the date could have been envious of you yeah they want to pay you off or something or they want to give back money something because they're facing bad karma tell me more spirit voodoo some sort of voodoo here is backfiring on somebody maybe something's back backfiring on somebody's ability to see so if someone here okay there could be a voodoo practitioner that is losing their intuition or their their ability to discern at this time because of fucking with you okay or there's somebody here who um paid someone to do something to you so that you can't see something so that you could lose your intuitive gifts or your ability to discern and now it happened to them i also feel like something could have happened to somebody's eyeball okay somebody here could have experienced an eye injury or something this could have been you or this is something that happened to someone trying to do some evil to someone okay or somebody who's been doing voodoo on you you see them clearly and they don't like it we have alcohol someone here could have an addiction to alcohol okay that was involved in doing this okay and doing this they were warned not to with this owl out here they were warned they're getting exposed okay for being evil we have black cat you're being divinely protected and you got luck on your side you guys could be seeing a lot of black cats at this time gemini this person could be a gemini that's getting fucked up or who was envious of you or flip it where it needs to go we have divine masculine's friend is secretly in love with him so divine masculine you got a friend that's secretly in love with you this could be another dude or another woman i don't know flip it where need to go you could have divine masculine you could have had a friend that was doing voodoo on you because they didn't want you to get to your north node this is someone a friend here who has a sex entity okay listen divine masculine if you have a, another male friend this male friend could be they could swing the other way okay this person could have been upset because you were in love with your divine feminine okay this person could have been mad because you want to be with a woman and not with a man okay you and this man could have done something together i don't know but that's the vibe i'm getting somebody whoever your friend is they have a sex entity on them they could be an incubus all right this person is addicted to your energy you let them have a taste and now they can't get enough i don't know what happened i don't know what you did But they went to the extent of even doing voodoo on you. So you wouldn't be with someone. That's for some of you. Not all y'all. That's not everyone's story. That's somebody's story though. This uh, divine mask on your friend could be a woman. I don't know. We have, it's not easy being the chosen one, but it's worth it. Keep going. All right. We have reminder. It says you are never alone. You have ancestors, angels, spirit guides, and God that are protecting you at this time. Something about tax evasion is of significance, child. Tell me more. What the hell going on? We have conspiracy to commit a crime. Somebody getting in trouble. Somebody getting exposed for conspiracy. And this is happening because you have a shield of protection around you. You are protected. Okay. What else they need to hear? Yeah, someone here is trying to set your ass up. Someone's trying to set you up. Are they still trying to? Whatever it is, pay attention. What's up with this setup, spirit? Yeah, someone's trying to set up to get you to get you robbed. To either take you away, okay, or remove you from your home or something, or have you disappear. All right, that's what the setup was. Or so that you can lose something or so the setup was so someone could abandon you that's another thing that i'm getting okay someone wanted to take from you they wanted to steal this love from you this union damn you and another person are a good match you guys are very much compatible okay 
there's a lot of loyalty and trust when it comes to this union someone was trying to take this from you people are sick bro you got a good gentleman coming your way ciao who was trying to set them up because i'm mad now this is your twin flame admirer twin flame tell me more libra your twin flame could be a libra okay a cancer a dog okay oh, this could go multiple ways for some of you you're a libra you're a cancer okay or you're in a twin flame union all right or there is a libra that was trying to set you up so that you would not get this this true love of yours okay or there was a cancer trying to set someone up so they don't get this new love or this true love okay or to be with their twin flame whichever it could be listen not everyone's supposed to be with their twin flame every lifetime it depends on because it takes two child but that's for some of you not all y'all i don't know which one is which <laughs> use your discernment I'm reading for a bajillion people. Okay. Ooh, and it's 111 on the clock. Use your discernment. Or someone here could have the Chinese zodiac sign of the dog. No, did they? That was trying to set you up. Okay. Whatever this is, this setup, it's not going to work. It's, it's not going to work. That's all you need to know, really. This is not going to work. trying to do voodoo so that you could be sad you could lose out you could be um resisting change be left out in the cold but that's not what's happening child this could have been a queen of swords that did so this is someone here who's harsh pessimistic critical calculating this is someone here who is spreading a lot of gossip okay um this is someone here who's easily influenced and has clouded vision queen of swords reverse so this is this is a very not nice person. This is someone here who's very emotionally detached. Like this is giving me sociopath almost, okay? This is someone who does not give a fuck about other people's feelings at all. This person may be heartless, okay? That was doing voodoo on you. It could have been an Aquarius for some of you. Don't have to be. <sighs> Someone who had big dick energy could have been this king of coins. Okay. Could have thought they were top shit. This could have been somebody who has a lot of money. Who was involved in trying to get a bunch of people to do something to you. Okay. This person knows they're going to jail. We got the Eight of Swords. This person could be a Capricorn. Don't have to be. This person's getting exposed, though. <laughs> this is beautiful. Yeah, someone getting exposed. For all their actions, when it comes to this solar eclipse, something is ending for show. Whatever magic someone was trying to throw at you, all of this is ending. This spiritual warfare bullshit, it's ending. And you're going to be receiving some sort of message. Or this is all ending because you learned uh, the, lead the needed le uh, lessons you were supposed to learn. Okay? The sun is coming out for you. We got the sun out here. You're going to be free. You got happiness on the way. 
And it's because you decided to stay courageous, stay strong, stay persistent, made choices with wisdom, stayed in your personal power, believed in yourself, all that jazz. Someone has a, wants us, there's someone here who wants a passionate new beginning with you, okay? That's another thing that's gonna be getting exposed as well. This is your justice. This is beautiful. What else they need to hear, Sperry? People are fucking, people are sick. What's going on? What do they need to hear, Spirit? We have family curse. It says someone is using magic to place generational curses on you and your family. I feel like whoever I'm speaking to, that's what they were trying to get you stuck with, with this voodoo. They're trying to get you to feel sad and unmotivated and, and so that you wouldn't get up and you wouldn't, Someone wanted you to give up on yourself. They wanted you to repeat a, a cycle or something here. Tell me more. Oh, we have a spiritually transmitted disease. It says, be careful. Someone courting or dating you is dealing with a lot of energetic burdens and dark entities. Yeah, there's someone here who has a dark entity attached to them. Be careful. We have love binding spell. It says, someone is working to have... You soul tied to them. I rebuke this in the name of Jesus. Hell no. Hell no. To the no, no, no. Hell to the no. Hell no. Hell no. No. We have sea salt power. It says use the cleansing and restorative powers of sea salt to remove negative energies from your body and your home. Okay. This is what you're being asked to do. Take a gosh dang bath. And if you don't have a bathtub, which I haven't had a bathtub or for a while, or I mean, I do now, but when I didn't, okay, um, I would do spiritual showers, okay? If you don't know how to do that, you need to look up, you can look up a tutorial on YouTube. Go on YouTube, look up how to take a spiritual shower, okay? Remember, it's not about the things that you have. It's about your magic, your intention inside of you that does that does the magic. Okay, people. Let me see. But salt does work. It really does. really doesn't want you to have love in your life i don't somebody's weird we have beauty looks allure and sex appeal fading away so somebody's beauty looks uh, allure or sex appeal is fading away or this is what someone wanted to happen to you so someone here might be start looking they might start looking a little uh fugly okay it's because they was trying to do something fucked up to you tell me more we have root chakra blocked it says Law, loses in safe or losses in safety security and a solid foundation um so someone here wanted you to lose your foundation but it's backfiring and it's happening to them that's sad someone doesn't feel safe they feel scared they feel they feel like they know they're in trouble we have being beaten at their own games yeah so someone tried to play a game with you and you fucking won child i don't even think you knew you were playing a game but this motherfucker that's crazy we have danger to themselves and others around them. So someone here is a danger. This person might get 5150, okay? Because someone feels like they don't have a reason to live. Okay, that's a little, that's, that's getting dangerous. Tell me more. Um, we have a dearest and precious dream being crushed to pieces. So someone here had some sort of dream here to destroy you. That's being destroyed. I also feel like someone here... Their dream was to destroy you, and it ain't happening. Like, they're they're trying to destroy your dreams. No. Suspended license. Someone here might end up having a suspended license. Damn. They might not be able to drive anymore. Maybe this is someone here who was stalking the shit out of you. We have divorce and taken for all they have. So, someone here is about to lose everything. Tell me more, spirit. 
And then we have eviction notice foreclosure. It says kicked out homeless couch surfing. So someone here is not going to have a place to live because they were trying to fuck with you. They're trying to destroy you in some way. We have carjack. This is robbery, grand theft auto. So someone here was either trying to steal your vehicle or whatever it is. They were trying to take from you. And now all this is happening to them. Or they might get the car stolen. I don't know. Because they were trying to steal something from you. <sighs> when will they ever learn? You know? When will people learn? Okay, I gotta end this soon. We got travel. Some of you might need to travel or someone here might be trying to pack up and go on the run. Okay, we have dirt digging. It says looking for dirt on you, vice versa. So someone here could be trying to look for something bad on you. This could have been somebody here who only married another individual for money. This is someone here who stole something from you. We have rob, lost, thief. Okay, someone here could be fake flexing. All right, someone here could have been cyberbullying you as well. People are sick. We got creativity. Someone here who steals your ideas, copies your work, feeds off you okay was trying to steal something from you but you're too busy because you're winning and you need to continue to stay unfazed all right that's pretty much it you got weird people around you trying to it is what it is um the the, the message just keeps repeating what else do they need to hear spirit we have if you pay close attention you will notice that all the doors that once closed are opening up just in a different form Things may not appear exactly as you had envisioned. But whatever you're manifesting is coming towards you. Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what else do they need to her? We have, it is time to stop letting worry rule you. Instead, get excited about your future and all it will bring. What energy and emotion you put out comes back to you with a little conscious effort on your part. That happy ending can and will be yours. Believe that. Believe that happy endings are for you, okay? You got a happy ending coming your way. This is beautiful. Tell me more spirit. What else they need to her? We have what areas of life are you avoiding? Are they causing you upset, worry, disrupted sleep? If so, these are the areas you need to focus on. As much as you don't want to, it is necessary. Tackle your demons head on. Don't allow them to rule you for a second longer. Right now is the perfect, perfect opportunity for you to take action when it comes to releasing shit that no longer serves you okay release the baggage it can't go with you just like those karmic people and toxic individuals can't come with you neither can you got staying baggage okay capiche someone could be italian capiche what else do you need to hear spirit before we bounce listen no one's perfect don't get mad at me we have have a spectacular day, okay? This is going to be the end of your message. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Until next time, I love you. Okay, bye.